So many of you might not know, but I worked at a camp this summer, Camp Barakel, and now I'm back at camp. I won't have a ton of time to shoot video, but anything that I shoot, I will edit and upload. And uh, yeah, I'm really pumped, I'm really excited. I'm just volunteering for the weekend doing various things, program things. And when we say program at camp, we don't mean like computer programming. Uh, we just mean the program that we facilitate for everybody. So that's the events and the games and all the activity areas, various things like that. So let's get going. So it's Saturday morning. I just woke up. I'm gonna go down to the boat dock and uh, watch the sunrise. It'll be fun. Breakfast is at 8.30 and then uh, I'll go do some work throughout the day. So growing up, I was in the Boy Scouts. Me and, that was kind of like what me and my dad did together. That was our little thing. So I've always kind of had an appreciation for the woods. I think it's really important. I think it's a good part of a, like a balanced life is learning to appreciate the world around us. <laughs> and that was a free negative wisdom. And now I'm walking along the lake to get back to my activity area that I have to run for the day. Um, running that Thunder Express was kind of like a, just like a giant slide. So we put them on the sled like these. And then we send them down the tube. Go all the way down this hill, kind of like a sledding hill, but requires no snow. And they pop out right at the end, right down there. Now I'm in the chapel. Pretty great, this looks kind of like a woodland lodge. There's a bear, there's a caribou. That's a moose, that's a savannah. Pretty exciting stuff. Now we're gonna sweep it all. And then the day with far. So you may be wondering why I'm filming a bunch and I'm not at all of that. It doesn't really connect. Um, but I want to connect it. So you spend so much time on campus and you spend so much time with your friends there and building relationships and getting involved with clubs. And I hope you're doing all those things. But sometimes you need to take time away from those things. You can become really overwhelmed with schoolwork and you become really overwhelmed with the clubs and, and organizations and all the responsibilities. You need time away from the campus. And for me, that time I find is very healthy and it helps me re-energize and recharge before jumping back into my responsibilities on campus. So this weekend, instead of uh, being busy and being uh, focused on schoolwork, I took some time and I came up to camp. And for, for me, camp is like a second home. So it's not so much that I left home to come here, but that I went back home and I spent some time just relaxing and serving. You know, there's, there's work that I did, you know, I did sweeping and I worked on the zip line and worked on the Thunder Express. Like, there's a lot of things that I did, but none of them are stressful. They were not, none of them are school related. And uh, I would like to encourage you to find some way to serve that allows you to get away from the distractions and like the intensity of school. All the good stuff that school has to bring and that college has to bring and all of that college has to offer, but um, you do need time away from it. So that's why I'm here. That's a way to connect it. I do want to thank all of our college for sponsoring all the blogs and vlogs that we do. They are fantastic. And if you have not checked out all of our college's website, uh, you should check it out. It's fairly new and it looks beautiful. And uh, if you want to come and visit the campus, please do. Um, if you want to see more of our vlogs, blogs, and other stuff, go to ocstories.com uh, or ocstories.edu. Go there instead. Or you can go to olliveatcollege.com and then find the OC Stories tab. Until next time, I'm Bruce Baker, signing off.